Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. And in this video, I want to talk to you about what are the things that huge YouTubers are doing right now to gain and retain their subscribers. Hi, my name is Lemuel and this is hashtag Lem Drops. Have you ever wondered what exactly huge YouTubers are doing? I mean, people like Mr. Beast, Nick Nimmin, and all those other guys that are just crushing it in the YouTube game. And you're wondering, how can I get into that? How can I become that person that everybody kind of leans on to, that everybody listens and subscribe to, and that if they upload a video, a ton of people like their video, even within that hour. I think Mr. Beast, you're talking about millions of people in one or two hours. What exactly are they doing that can help me level up my YouTube into that stratosphere? And it's just one thing. You want to hear it? It's called serving. Yes, that's exactly what they're doing. They're looking at their YouTube content. They're looking at their YouTube titles. They're looking at their thumbnails so that they can make sure that what they are sharing in their content is actually speaking to the audience that is following them. And I heard this through Clubhouse conversations from Mr. Beast himself, from Nick himself, and all the other big YouTubers that are talking. It is what? Give value to your subscribers, find their pain point, and serve them. That's the big word right now. Serve them. Don't look at all the statistics. Don't look at all the demographics. Don't look at the informatics in a way that tries to tell you what is your new thing. Rather, get back to the old thing. Serve the people that are coming onto your channel and looking for you for an answer. What is exactly their needs are? If you are a niche, or as they would say, niche, make sure that you're responding to the needs of those that are following your channel. Make sure you're looking at what they're doing, looking at the questions. They teach us to make sure that your titles lines up with the questions that people are searching. Because if you don't know it yet, let me tell you, YouTube is the second largest search engine in all the world, y'all. And people are typing up their questions. And if you would just do what these huge YouTubers are doing, which is finding their value point in where their audience are needing most, then you can succeed. It's about giving after all. It's not about you. You got to go from being serving you and what you desire and what you think you want to do and what you think you want to you want to uh, provide into what are people coming to me for? What are their questions? What are their hurts? What are their queries? What are they thinking about? What are their enjoyments? What are the things that they're pursuing? Now, of course, you've got to enjoy what you are doing as well, but hope that you would anchor your joy in meeting people's needs. Because in this economy, it's those that are giving into people's needs they're going to climb up the ladder of success and going to find themselves massively explosive. Hey, that's it for me. If you enjoy that video, go ahead and like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you have not yet. If you have subscribed, thank you so much. And for those that have not yet done so, ring that notification bell so that YouTube will know that you want to hear from me. And don't forget to watch the other videos on this channel about the giving economy. I really believe that it can change your perspective for the better. And if you really want to, you can learn how to leverage your giving so that you will be ready and position to gain by what? Serving others. Until next time, y'all, keep on giving. Peace. Never before. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen, I bring to you the man, right. the myth. You got me <laughs> hype over here, bro. Right? Find their pain point. Find their pain point.